All right, so here it is. There it is. There is a little phone I'm going to use. And this phone is going to actually demonstrate from really up close what exactly the situation is. It's going to be recorded right now. Everything. Now, this is uh, just a detailed procedure. And you have to prepare yourself to be capable eventually to see really what goes on in first recording the first thing i realized this thing is not glued keep in mind there is a watch in here yeah there is a watch i gotta see online which is the one which one was it? But I'm not going to say anything right now. There were two. Just like this. And I got to make sure about something else too. And I'm not going to say what. That, that stayed a little secret for now. As that, that, that much more this thing is going to be interesting. So I like to get inside of the heads of the police. I like to get inside of their heads to get a better overview about how they think their thinking patterns basically are of interest to me that's what every police officer is interested when dealing with the criminals This here, there is no super glue on a scenario. I did request the super glue. On a scenario, if I would request the super glue, please uh, explain to me. No, this is not a super glue. This is actually, let me see, very, very easy to open stuff. You just hold like this and it's just coming apart. What prompts me a suspicion that this might have been actually repackaged. What exactly I mean by this is that police knew in MK Ultra they warned me about a super glue option if I would ever dare to use one. And for that option, you see, I don't actually have to do much. So we're going to open right through here, straight from here because I request it to be super glued item so that's how we're gonna open one see this so this time I'm not gonna have to cut this envelope in absolutely any way now they told me that if you will have sellers super glue the item what's gonna happen is we're going to repackage this into another, this thing that you see. Therefore, open. You see how, how nicely it opens? It pops so beautifully open. And uh, have the stickers placed back on there. And for the first proof that this actually probably did happen, I'm pretty sure that exactly what it happened. I'm going to tell you that this package arrived in my home with a record fast speed. What exactly I mean by this is that they couldn't lie. They couldn't cheat. Because they, whether they like it or not, had to register one at the customs. You cannot lie because you cannot open one. If you understand what I mean. They know that this here, you see right now, is going to happen eventually. When you super glue an envelope, it's got to go through the customs. And it's got to be reported when it reaches the customs. And that's exactly the idea was behind my request to Chinese sellers to use a super glue. A typical item like this, 
would take two months before one would arrive to me to Slovenia. It now arrived in a relatively, I'm gonna say, very fast. Um, this is a four dollar item. This thing here that you see, this is a four euro item. Four euros. It arrived to me in a very, very fast um, shipping services, whatever you call. So I'm pretty sure that this is not the original. Definitely, there is no trace of super glue anywhere. Unless the seller who did not respond anything to me just proceeded to send this with a regular nothing special delivery option nothing in respect to super glue option and have uh, enclosed this thing in a such a way that would be extremely extremely easy to open I open it right now in front of you I didn't need any special machines and stuff like this so let's see this kind of stuff and so we get an idea what exactly is inside in here and before I will do this let me go and let me raise this thing here to have a complete complete overview of this from a little up higher like this so let's see what is going on. This is not, was not open anywhere. You can see this is sealed nice. And I did exactly what you have seen, have done it. Now let's see this. Notice that uh, the watch already is functioning, already it's in operating condition. Uh, something I will request from the seller, I will want to find out why is it working. Um, notice that, aha, uh -huh, okay, the sticker is on the top. Notice that. Well, I tell you what, let's, um, let's have, um, let's have a very, very close deja vu with this thing. Let's inspect this thing very, very thoroughly. As a matter of fact, I'm going to inspect this thing visually first, because I want to get a very, very close detailed view on one for anything I would note is wrong with it I can immediately take action against special interest to me right here the screws represent I can tell you that I can already see from here that this is not evenly closed and you see the gap right there between the cover in the back and plastic clearly can be seen that is not screwed all the way somebody had a mindset on this screw here did not tie the one completely as otherwise should and um, what also can be seen right here is you look from like this from the side you can see that the screw is standing out clearly somebody already was inside of the watch
you see that hmm it's so easy actually when you start to pay a close attention to this stuff when you're not fucking around anymore when you're in no hurry anymore like this That's what neurosis is. That's what pathos makes people. When they fucking you up absolutely everything on every step of the way, you just disregard and you just go about things and you just pick up destroyed stuff and so on and, and you go and you start to collect this stuff and without noticing, without understanding, knowing what goes on, you, you have a whole junkyard at home. I've noticed, um, let me pay close attention to that, I've noticed the same thing, professionally somebody have already unscrewed this thing, I know so because I'm a mechanical engineer and technician, uh, also note that this is already all scratched, you can see the back, that one does not look as new, right, you can see from far away that this is everything but new. It's possible that the engine inside already was replaced with some other engine. Uh, which best can be seen by my removing the light like this. Do you see what this is? This is used watch. This is not a new watch. You can see that here is on this side it's already faded. And I can tell you from professional experience that you know who did this? This is what professional individual whoever did this stuff. The way you screw these things is by basically going this, 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 this. You understand? He failed to screw this and this. And you can see, it can be seen here on the side that also is not even on this side. It's used, somebody was using this watch already for some time and when one opened the watch he failed to close on properly the cover. So I'm gonna make some beautiful photos of it. It's all scratched in the back too and that's gonna do for me. So. That's how we're going to document. You see the, the screw, how it is standing out also on this side? The same thing like on the other side. I'm a mechanical engineering technician also by profession. That's also one of my professions. When I started to put detail on this shit, you're going to be crying. You see how it's unscrewed? It's unscrewed. It's not, it's not, it's not tied all the way because it was open and it was not all closed all the way. It was, in other words, it was a shitty work. It was, um, now it's time, I don't know if I can video record this stuff, but now it's time to prove that also from the back, from a little up closer, uh, it's full of scratches in the back. And so this uh, pleased me. You see the scratches? This watch is all fucking scratched. This is not a new watch. This is not a new product. And so next to the, I don't know what am I going to do? whether eventually I will go ahead and request the money back that I have to think about. That will depend entirely on seller whom I will ask questions and anyone will not bother to answer the questions then yes I am gonna have to do my part. I obviously will remove this thing away
it's scratched also up front I can see the scratches here too this is not it's scratched the watch is scratched I can see the The watch has scratches, absolutely has a scratches. Yep. And that stuff I am going to record with another telephone that I have right there. So I'm going to, for the very close evaluation in front of this telephone, I am going to use this phone. What you see now. This is going to be the phone that's going to determine the whole value from a little up closer so that you get to see actually how I video record this stuff and what will be also posted it's not a lot of scratches however this is a scratched watch already clearly uh, police officers investigators played with this watch uh, watches as seen here they have them in possession before those watches were even produced on a large scale scratch scratched uh, the edges are the most evident basically when you look at the edge you can see the biggest evidence of uh, scratch the next thing that we have to inspect also is a belt that is a sensitive that is also what easily can expose abuse also in this case I anticipate uh, that the watch itself you see what this is <laughs> look at that if I were to open this it would be interesting to see what exactly I would found inside ah okay very nice we can see this from up closer Yeah, I can actually take uh, the nail, my nail, and I can probably just push one right in between here. It's a, such a big gap. You see it?
the belt however is original the belt I don't see that there will be any at least on this side I don't see any kind of uh, there will be any damage or anything no uh, Chinese for Euro watch is just like this a new this is a replica of the Casio watch and they are very high quality in my opinion if they come to you as new as what you pay for that's what I paid I paid this I paid to obtain a new item I didn't pay to obtain this and um, if you get if you happen to get a new item or well, what you pay for you get a new item you don't get uh, what you see here what is this here that's a scratch right there too another scratch You know, I guarantee you that in the factory, manufacturers don't throw them all over the fucking place. I'll tell you that much. They do take care of them with a special care. I know what a production service is like. Oh. No, I, I, I'll tell you, I'm going to simplify this for you, this stuff here. This was changed. The, the watch, this watch was changed. New belts were just thrown on one. It's not difficult to see. Oh. Um, I got yet to see this stuff here. Uh, you have to inspect to see whether I'm even unsure whether the screws are the same so what can I say this this is the another police plot this is another another problem and I have to disappoint you but it's again exactly as they told me the case is gonna be even the package the way it was placed at the door entrance on the floor it was exactly according to MK Ultra scenario so another case of uh, police interference is recorded let me see something else here hmm seems like uh, this here also is all fucked up oh so this goes already at some other issues now oh, look at that before you start wearing it is already like this you remember when I told you that when you go to locations and it's um, they just you go you put yourself on hand or whatever uh, you pick it up something somebody even gives you everything is fucked up so it's good to video record what you actually get so you don't look completely insane so you don't look uh, like somebody who is just causing a havoc is destroying everything left and right. That's important stuff. All right, I don't have anything else to say in respect to this video. And eventually, probably would be good to even open one. Maybe that wouldn't be. That wouldn't hurt. If police opened one, I'm thinking maybe I should open one too to see basically what is uh, inside in one. Maybe I really should do this. It's a beautiful watch. It's a beautiful product. 
Uh, I know exactly what I buy. I buy the best for less. Um, but the people that make my life ugly through their eyes for 28 years already have anticipated by doing this would eventually, if no violence would be produced, eventually would end up with my creating a statements based on which they would then yeah but I don't have the right tools here so because I don't have the right tools and this is in a fairly good shape watch with much bigger numbers than what I have now you know this is this is why I bought this because I have a problem seeing numbers and uh, this makes things so much better so much clearer uh, I am not just gonna go and just open one I will inform you basically what was found in one after I purchased myself and rather a new set of these screwdrivers because I don't want to go and destroy them that's the thing I don't want to go and just open something without uh, a really really proper tools simple as this it all depends on the seller what he's gonna tell me about this stuff